all right welcome guys welcome back to another episode of mac vismo i'm your boy mac vismo today i'll be showing you how to clear up others that are taking up space in your iphone storage that i have to do this so stay tuned <laughs> All right, so welcome back. So basically, I am going to show you how um, how to remove that the others that's in your um, storage that taking up space. You know, so first of all, what you're going to do. All right, so step one, you want to go to settings. When you go to settings, you want to, I just type in storage. So it's S T O and I just go in storage right here. It's easier to type. So it's gonna load and it's gonna break down everything to you. As you can see, the red um, is apps and the yellow is photos. Um, um, the uh, dark gray is system, green is message, media is purple and other is gray. So other here is taking up, like I show you, 16 gig. So what you can do for the first step what you can do is go into settings and you're gonna go back cancel you're going to find Safari let's scroll down to Safari find Safari and usually we browse a lot with our phone so Safari would store a lot so you want to scroll down where you see clear history and website data by doing that you will free up some of the memory so you're just going to clear that and what we're going to do we're going to go back to search storage s t o r and we're going to go into storage here uh let's see how many memory we clear up by doing that um we still have 16 i did clear it it's still 16 it was like 28 gigabytes by doing that on my iphone i did um clear it so if you did this and it didn't work i'm going to be honest with you so i'm going to be honest with you if you're you if the phone memory that you're using is like um 64 gigabyte or if you're using an older iphone model that has the 32 gigabyte um i would recommend upgrading your memory um I do have the 256, but I do spend one dollars a month. It's 99 cents, and you can upgrade your memory. Apple, um, I think that's affordable for it. So if you have 32 gigs or 64 gigabyte, I would recommend this to you, so you could put most of your files in there and save a lot of uh, files to it. A lot, it will be a lot better. So if let's say we you, you don't want to upgrade, it's fine. Uh, your memory is full. Most of it is used. Most of it, most of the space is taken up by other. So the next step that I'm going to tell you is actually how it worked for me because this phone, uh, this is my iPhone 8. What I had to do to clear up most of it because all of it was, it's 64 gigabytes. All of it was taken up by other. I'm going to show you what I actually had to do. It's only two steps I'm going to show. If it doesn't work with one, it will work with two. So throughout the life of your phone that you have it, everything that you do isn't just deleted even though you delete apps you delete all these other stuff your phone still save those cash you have to re reset the settings so i'm gonna show you how you go ahead and do that so go to your iclouds and you want to back as you can see i manage my icloud storage i'm gonna show you here my iCloud storage, I have 50 gig that i took i bought i paid uh, 99 cents a month for this one so um, I know I have too much, but I do prioritize what I save on my iClouds. Like um, apps is all on my phone. Uh, my photo iCloud using, I'm just gonna turn that, it's off. I don't use that. I use only the share album, but I turn everything off because I don't need it. I have enough memory on my phone for that. So what you wanna go ahead and do is make sure you highlight everything that you can on your phone and you are going to back all of that up to your itunes um you're gonna back all of that up to your iclouds account which is which i recommend that just back everything up to your I, itunes account once you have that on um show you let's go in right here because you want to save most of the files that you want to save so you're just going to go to backup 
So right here, it will show you um, the iPhone, the last backup, what it is to show you here, a gig, uh, 37 megabytes. I really don't save too much. I really don't save too much on here. So what, so then you want to make sure you hit backup. You're going to back up guys. And again, guys, I'm sorry. You have to reset your phone. Basically, um, if you're using a phone, if you're using all this, if you have that terabyte or two terabyte of storage, you just have to do the same. If you really want that memory to be gone, if you don't like seeing it, you just have to do it. Um, once you get that done, what you're going to go in, you're going to scroll, go in settings, scroll down to general, and then you're going to scroll down to reset. And, um, I know most options says reset settings all settings it's not gonna work i'm being honest it's not gonna do much for you so basically you have to hit reset all settings it will it will ask you many times um if you want to do that uh it's gonna ask if you back up all the iclouds and stuff it will, it will repeatedly ask you about that it will repeatedly ask you to do it i'm not gonna back up anything right now so you're just gonna um, go from there, set up back, set everything up, and it will be an easy setup just as when you bought the iPhone. So guys, um, this, I'm your boy Mac Vismo. If this video helped you out, um, please like and subscribe, share, hit that bell icon. Um, I really appreciate everyone that watched my video, but this is the easiest way to get rid of others that took that's taking up your storage on your iPhone. So again, you don't know. Big up yourself.